So Viffa Fontaine comes out along with multiple five-star characters. We finally have Yula rerun after over 9,000 years. So without any more delay, let's go over her build. Her skill Ice Tide Vortex does a slashing prior damage and creates a Grim Heart Stack. Grim Heart Stack increases her defense and resistance to interruption. After gaining 2 stack, if you hold her skill, it explodes, dealing physical damage to nearby opponents. You can have 1 stack after pressing the skill, but because of her passive talent, you can gain another stack if you use her ult. Most of her damage though comes from her ult, so let's go over that. Her ult other than dealing cryo damage creates a light pulse to her, which lasts for 7 seconds. During these 7 seconds, her normal attack and elemental skill adds stack to this light pulse to her. After 7 seconds, the Light Pulse Sword will explode dealing physical damage to nearby enemies. The more stack you have, the more damage it will deal. For her normal attack combos, do 4 normal attacks then dash cancel for optimal damage. As for her ult, use E to get 1 Grimheart stack, then use ult to get another stack, then hold E to explode the Grimheart stack. After that, for the rest of the 7 seconds, continue to do 4 normal attacks and dash cancel. For Eula's artifacts, 4 sets of Pale Flame would be the best choice, but if you don't have a good 4 set, then 2 sets of 25% physical attack would do the job as well, or 2 sets of 18% attack can also be viable. As for the main artifact stat, have Attack Sand, Physical Damage Goblet, and Crit Damage Crown. For the specific stats, have 130 to 40 ER since you will be running her with a battery unit and realistically speaking anything above 50% crit rate and 160% crit damage is pretty good. But you can always go for more crit damage in case of Eula because of how her burst works. You can go for 5 to 1 ratio instead of typical 2 1 or 3 1 ratio that you go for other characters. So her stat priority would be crit damage, crit rate, physical damage, ER and then attack percent. Her best in slot 4 star weapon would be Aku Maru or if you have battle pass then Serpent is fine. Other than those, among the FTP choices you can run Luxurious Sea Lord, a Snow Tomb Star Silver or Prototype Arcade. And among the 5 stars, Song of Broken Pine is obviously the best, but Beacon of Reed Sea would be a better choice if you're wishing on a weapon banner. This is an old weapon ranking for Eula. For her core team comps, you basically want a Cryo Battery to recharge her ult, an Electro Unit to Superconduct and reduce the physical resistance of enemies. And the last one can be to your Lucky. If you need a shield, then you can go with Zhongli or Chi Chi if you need heals. For Cryo Battery, Diana with Sacrificial Bow or Rosaria with Pavonius Lance would be a really good choice. For Electro, Raiden, Kishil, Bedo, Lisa, Sinobu, or Dori. If you have more constellation of any of those characters, you can go with that character most of the time. All of them are pretty good for different reasons. This is an ER requirement depending on your team comes if that helps you build your team. So yeah, that's it for the video. If you have any question, you can ask them in the comments. And thanks for watching.